Hey, this is Mike Wolf at CS Unveiled with Dr. Randall Wilkinson, the CEO of Wilkinson Baking Company. Yes. And we have your bread making robot back there with a huge crowd around. <laughs> it is. People are excited about this thing. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about it. Well, it's the first time that bread can be made in a fully automated fashion from start to finish. You're working with a biological organism, the right. yeast and food substances, which are kind of persnickety. And to use an automated mechanical kind of thing to do it, nobody's figured out how to do that until we did that. So it's the first time it's ever been done, start to finish automated baking in the store. So the store can have it start up at three in the morning, nobody's there. They come in at six in the morning, there's already fresh bread ready for people to, to take home. And through the day, there's fresh bread continually coming out of the oven that they can take home fresh, hot out of the oven. And you see this possibly going in grocery stores, I think. We talked a little bit about that. And in most grocery stores, 99% of the bread is some, from some factory somewhere yeah. shipped there. It's not fresh at all. You guys want to change that. You want to make fresh bread made in the grocery store. Exactly. Things that we think of as fresh are often produced in a factory, often a distance, frozen, and weeks or months later, just finished baked in the store. That's not fresh. It's been frozen and thawed. What this does is to bake it fresh, in front of the consumer, they see it, they know it's fresh, no preservatives needed, all natural. So it's a great way to give the consumer what they're looking for. And you see the crowd that's here at, yeah. the, at CES, well, that happens in the stores too. What happens is as a consumer comes in and says, well, what's this? Right. And the kids are drawn in by it. the smell of the bread and, and they, they see this thing making loaves of bread. They're, and if you're a retailer, yeah. you say, that's what I want. Right. It reminds me a little bit of, I don't know if you've heard of Bellwether. They're actually a, kind of a democratized uh, small coffee roaster. So like they actually roast coffee in a coffee shop. It's kind of a small size, yep. similar to that. Yep. Or like Creator. So we're seeing technology around robotics democratizing very, very hyper-local creation yep. of food in venue. It's, imagine taking a $150 million big bread factory, slicing it up into small pieces, move that out into the grocery store and make it fresh there rather than happening at the, at the factory. And this is not something that's going to be available in two, three years as proof of concept. This is something you guys are going to ship in about a, next quarter? Right. Q2 of 2019, we're going to be testing in proof of concept testing in some of the major retailers, grocery retailers in the U.S. And can we see as grocery retailers, maybe also kind of small uh, restaurants or where, where, do you, where all do you see it going? All of the above, okay. uh, and we're working our way through with potential partners for that kind of thing. And it's not one of these things where, uh, we talked a little bit about the business model, where people are actually buy it and they're gonna own it fully. You guys have more of a managed ownership model because you wanna make sure, take have full control over the quality. The, in contrast to, let's say, an oven in a right. bakery, you don't know whether the corner baker or the grocery store down the street has X oven or Y oven. But if you walk into a store and you see that bread bot, and then you walk into another store and you see a bread bot, you say, oh, this is gonna be the same bread. But if this retailer is cutting corners on what the quality of that bread is, then you're not gonna buy from any of them. And so in order to maintain the quality and the desirability and the reliability for everyone, under a lease model, it works much better. Well, I wish you guys could smell the bread from the bread bot wafting over, because it smells yeah. really good. Randall, thank you for spending time with me. It's been great. Absolutely. Right. Good.